Have you ever been to a sperm bank? It's not the first place I'd recommend for a day out, to be honest with you. It's not exactly all sunshine and rainbows, unless you have a penchant for worn-out vintage born. I mean, who doesn't love bashing one out into a plastic cup whilst looking at blurry pictures of Debbie from Blackpool Reader's Wives 1992? It's fucking ridiculous. I'm in my twenties. People in their twenties don't get cancer. I'm meant to be having a laugh. Drinking, dancing, being reckless. Not wanking into a cup to make sure I can still have kids because I'm about to drop a bollock. I mean, it could be worse. I'm not exactly dying. They pretty much just lop it off and then I get to become a one ball wonder. Join the ranks of people like Lance Armstrong and Hitler. <laughs> Whoop de fucking do. Don't get me wrong, I'm thankful. I know I'm looking in the grand scheme of things, but I'm not exactly going to be doing a victory lap around the garden when it's all done. It's going to be weird. I wonder if it's going to feel different, like I'll be lopsided or I'll just get used to it after a while. It's going to look weird as well. Grace says she doesn't mind. be fucking lost without her. She just wants me to be okay and I promised her I will be. We'll be fine. I'll be fine. Nay, at least we've got my frozen spunk for future baby making just in case. <laughs>